Hello everyone, I'm Ria Zolarik once more. Thank you so much for logging on to this channel. If this is your first time logging on, please hit the subscribe button and become a part of this family. If you are a retaining viewer, thank you so much. I appreciate the level of support and please continue supporting my efforts. Um, today, I'm here on one of my construction sites. Um, this project was given to me by someone in the diaspora. Um, and in this video, we'll be doing maybe a short tour of um, the electrical works we've done since we took over this project. And don't get it twisted. Sir, I haven't asked for permission to do this, but please allow me to do so. Please, sir. So, once again, I appreciate you so much for empowering me, empowering my team, empowering young Liberians. Um, and I want to acknowledge others in the diaspora or others who are into construction into this country to make use of my team because we are full of professional people who can do professional job. So please stick and stay, watch this video to the end so that you can see, you know, some of the decisions we've made when it comes to the electrical part of this job. Thank you. We are here in the living room area. So we have this receptacle. Um, we assume that the television will be somewhere here. And most of the televisions nowadays are smart televisions as one. And also these televisions have their connections on this side, on the left hand side. So we put this receptacle here so that you will just maybe take the, the cord of the television and plug it into here. But if um, the television will not be a wall mounted, we have another one here, which is this. So this now, if you have a stand here, this will be used. And the this receptacle or this utility cup right next door will be used for internet, cable internet. So this also is for lights, wall-mounted lights. So we have wall-mounted light here. Another in the corner there. So we come to this. This will be used mostly for maybe air condition and so forth. So this will be used for charging phones. So yeah, folks, yeah, we have it. This is a little wall mounted leg. And then we come, this is the kitchen area. This is the kitchen area, as you can see. So the decision we've made here in this kitchen area, right? We know that um, the sink or the, the sink will be somewhere here. It will be about three feet or 36 inches from the floor. So it will stop somewhere here. So once the countertop will stop somewhere here, you will also you will have this receptacle that will be between the countertop and the cabinet. So right in the middle will be um, these receptacles. So these receptacles will be used for maybe microwave, maybe percolator, and so forth. So this will be right in the middle of the sink or the countertop and then the cabinet. So this is it, this is um, a switch, a switch. This is another switch and also um, this is a wall mounted light. We are in one of the rooms and in this room, similar system um, of what we have in the living room. So this is a normal or regular receptacle. This will be used for internet cable internet and this will be used for television just um, in case you decide to wall mount your television and this is a wall light and one thing that is very very key and interesting i must say you see these two these two receptacles let me zoom okay this and this other receptacle 
washout, right? So these two receptacles, so this is the laundry room and in this laundry room, we've installed receptacles on the wall for maybe washing machine, maybe dryer and so forth. So this other receptacle will be used to power on um, the water heater that will be installed here or into this corner. And also we have the panel bags. This, you can see the size of the panel bags. We are not playing when it comes to coring. So the panel bags is an um, 18 breaker panel bags. And this will simply break the current. So let's assume once the current comes from um, whatever source, maybe LEC, it comes in the panel box here. So this panel box will break this current. Um, mostly we've, we've decided to break the current into three different portions. So send the current into three different di directions into this house. So these two receptacles you are seeing, this receptacle and that receptacle, will be used for receptacle and also switch. So on one side, we have um, a receptacle and the other side we have a switch. And it is simple, right? One side will be used to charge phone and the other side will be used to control whatever light that will be up here in this room. So, because this is the idea, right? We are trying to solve problem. This is the, the essence of engineering. I have seen, right? That in all of the houses or most of the houses in Liberia, right? You will be lying down, maybe at nine o'clock, 10 o'clock, the light is on, you are using and when you are about to go to bed, you have to get up from maybe your bed to go walk way to the door just to turn off the light. So that problem, we are trying to solve it. Right from, from your bed, you can control the light in here. So this, I think it is a brilliant idea and I think it is maybe new to Liberia. So this is another receptacle. Maybe this person will want to have a table here, you know, for study purposes. So he can use that to, to plug his, his laptop or so. And that will be used for air conditioning. So you see it, folks, you can entrust us. You can, you can empower us as well. We'll do similar things for you. So we are claiming the stairs and you see, Along the stairs, we also have lights. You see it? Lights. You just imagine how crazy, how beautiful this will be along the stairs. So all of these cups, you see here, lights will be installed into them. So you see? My people, they're trying to empower us. These are our switch. So we are in um, the bathroom. Yeah, so this bathroom, we have a switch there and another switch. And these two receptacles will be used for, um, maybe to plug in a, a shower, yeah, an electronic shower or so. Yeah, electric. So these two receptacles will be used to plug in um, electric shower so and here we have maybe a glass in the middle here and that is a wall light that will be there so we are again in another room and the system is the same you know as that room so once again these two will be used to switch on and switch off um, whatever light that will be um, install into this room right from your bed and we look at the you know drawing and then we find out that yes the bed will be right here so what we did we took um, the length of the bed um, that is six feet 
and then we took the the length of um, the two drawers one drawer is two feet and the next is is two feet so the two feet two feet we divided it by two and then we we added it only six feet making it eight inches so this should be i think somewhere around eight eight feet sorry eight feet eight feet apart so yes the bed will be in the middle and right underneath you have the drawer resting here so once you have your your drawer or your cupboard resting there you can wrap from the top of the cupboard you will be able to maybe plug your phone or maybe plug your your how how, how should i say it um, um, so from right at the top of the, the dryer you can be able to plug your phone yeah or your your bed light from right here. and also this side will be used to switch on the switch off so we are entering the master bath yes one is septical has been installed into this bathroom because you see here a jacuzzi will be placed here so the back of the jacuzzi will face this and we all know right that jacuzzi needs to be powered right so we install this receptacle here so that the jacuzzi will use it to put it on and so forth so folks yeah this this is the job that we do so you can contact us through this page or you can reach us on messenger or on whatsapp my number is right there for whatever construction work you want us to do you can just contact our services we are available and Trust me, whatever way you want the construction, we we'll deliver. We don't care. If somebody is poor your foundation, if somebody is poor your construction, hire our services. We will fix it. We will repair it. When it comes to construction, we are truly the mechanic. So once again, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Rio Zolaric is the name. Thank you so much.